And we're back! As I recall, last time they said something about the de the needing a ship. And now the only ship I know of is half embedded in Sabrosia and half kind of down here. So we're going to head down there first and see if we have any clues about leads on the bell. Because it's clearly not part of the trading quest. Oh, maple, but that was kind of a terrible hey, person. Okay. Something in the Moblin's Keep? But we were already there, and explored it and everything, and blew it up. That's what this guy has to say. Clearly we're not going to be able to get this open without him gone, so... Let's go to the Subrosian side and see what we can see. Oh, and ring appraisal. Okay. The you killed a whole bunch of stuff ring. Doesn't do anything, but go murder. Huh, so oh pa. Let's try to not do that this time. Captain's a player, eh? Well, he said to find his bell now, so... And search the ship. Because, I mean, clearly we need a code to get through that wall anyway. This seems to still not be getting us anywhere. but at least we should be able to make that guy move now. Let's do some pushing. You never know, really. There haven't been any ghosts coming out at us. Yes, the captain thinks we're competent. Oh, ah. Ah. Okay. One, two, three. Okay. 
I should be able to hold that in my mind. And with being told we can replace him... Yep. Bingo. Creepy desert music. And enemies from Mario games. This is probably just a dumping ground for that pit. I'd rather not have to search all the pits. Cactus! I wonder if there's a ring that makes you immune to cactus. Ha! No booms. Oh, this is a... You could have just put a fairy in the cave, I mean... We have missed some screens. Aha! Find his skull in the desert. I'm going to bet his skull is probably in that hole, really, but... Oh, there it is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Heck. Well, let's check down here, though, since he was yabbering. Must get head. Aha! Huh. 
Haha! <laughs> uh, yeah, we're probably gonna need to get this thing fixed. We can probably get this fixed from the same people who fit got our sword forged up, really, because they like... Flag! I don't like like this. Yeah, they take jobs that interest them, so... Maybe this will ring their bell. <laughs> so it does kind of weird me out that the implication on that is that the way their ship is, Subrosia is a weird inner sphere of, like, upside-down land. Let's talk to the captain about this first, though. Yeah, I didn't think that would do. I'm gonna guess we need those guys who smelt, or, or whatever. Best way to get to them, though, I'm still not a Subrosian navigational expert, so... We're just gonna have to... Oh, I know that's not it, so... There's not even a point in going there. Link and his magnetic personality. Bees, bees, and the musical shoot. The more they eat, the more they do it. I don't even know. Something about bees. We got St. Patrick's Day coming up soon, and Link's perfectly prepared. Ah! Do it! Do it now! I just wish we had a way to get more distance. I did the Rock's Feather as L1 next to it, so it will probably get upgraded and be able to jump that gap right about the time there's no point to it. Avast! Away with us!
Go, pirates! That doesn't look good. I guess their sea legs all rotted off. Wow, even the captain. Arr, captain, you gave it all you got. At least you were able to pull into port. Thank you, Captain. You done well. Well, if that doesn't scream, you're getting the Rock's Feather upgrade next dungeon. I don't know what does. Weather needs to be summer, then. a house. I like their conspicuous bomb placement. It's almost like someone said, there should be an obstacle here, but what if they don't have bombs? You know, just kind of negate the entire purpose of your puzzle. And watch this be someone's beach house and the real puzzle is getting back through. Crazy pirates! <laughs> now we're in the graveyard! So if we can somehow get here in the fall, eh? But we'll worry about that next time, after we clear the Explorer's Crypt! Later, everyone!